All right, hello, and God bless everybody. In the name of our Lord and our Savior, Jesus Christ. Um, been able to witness with a few people here and there. Um, I had to call in a uh, doctor to check out my prescription that I had in Tennessee um, for an uh, inhaler. And uh, I ended up witnessing with him and uh, asked him if he knew the times we were living in. And he said he did. And uh, so he said, how do you not see it? And yet, yeah, I asked him, I said, well, you didn't take the stuff that, you know, everybody's taking. He goes, no. He goes, I didn't. He goes, a few other people that I know didn't. He goes, I tried talking to my parents and then not doing it, but they did it. Um, and I said, see, that's where we've been led by the spirit. We knew not to do what they're doing. And I said, this is where everybody's being separated. You know, and we have to, uh, you know, know, just we know not to do what they're doing. You know, and uh, sadly, a lot of people aren't aware of this. And, uh, but we're able to tell who's who. And that's why it says you'll know them by their fruit, what they're doing. You know, this is a, uh, it's a, it's totally, it's a uh, separation, what's happening. Everybody's being separated. And uh, it's not a pleasant thing to go through. But at the same time, Jesus, he tells us who our family is. You know, our true family. We have to look at this spiritually. Not through the flesh, you know, because the flesh, you know, it's like it says, it profiteth nothing. You know, look through it like the spirit and how Jesus said who my true family are. My sheep hear my voice. See, a lot of us, we knew we weren't going to do it. We knew that there was a lot of things we were being lied to about. A lot of things, you know. Uh, but anyhow... Be strong, you guys. I didn't bring anything. I have to go down and just pick up my medication now. So I don't have anything to uh, read right now. We'll do it um, in the room later today. Um, I just wanted to share that with you guys. Um, our brothers and our sisters, we know who they are. That other, uh, everything, you got to look at it all spiritually. Because everything is spiritual. God, you're seeing everything he's done through the vessels that he created. The vessels to honor and dishonor. And when you see them doing things and it's repulsive, well, that's God's doing. He put these things in their place. He made all things from the very beginning. That's why we, he declares the end from the beginning. And this is how we can see what he's doing. The guy that wrote that... Uh, Star Spangled Banner. That's who they named that bridge over that collapsed. You know, and this place is going to collapse too. You can be sure of it. A lot of people don't realize what's about to happen, man. And it is going to happen. You know, this place is going to collapse. And that's why I was witnessing with him, you know, and he was an online doctor like, and uh, what they do is they they check you out, they check out your history and everything, they find out everything that they have on file about you. And then uh, he basically called up the pharmacies to see what I had before and uh, prescribed the exact same thing as what I had before. Now I'm just waiting to be able to go pick it up. But uh, it's just a, a, a air thing that you do that opens your lungs up to where you can breathe better. <laughs> I've been told, you know, I have uh, um, like a COPD and I have scarred lungs as well. I was told even if they put me on oxygen, it wouldn't matter. You know, at this point, it only worsens. <laughs> but I'm not worried about it, you guys, because like I said, I know the time is drawing near. We're soon going to be out of here. You know, we're soon going to be out of here. Um, we're biding time right now. That's all we're doing. 
and we trust in the Lord and Him only. We don't follow anything that the world is doing. If they tell you to follow something and do something, you don't do it. We follow Christ. We follow His teachings only. God bless you guys. I love you all. In the name of our Lord and our Savior, Jesus Christ.